Death is my duty! Your duty is to the Emperor. You will die when and where he so chooses, not over some personal vendetta. So what makes Chiron completely lose it in this entire section? And gameplay-wise, he is separated from Titus and Gadriel over here, and you're trying to keep up with him as he's cutting through a significant portion of Chaos Space Marines of the Thousand Suns. Well, he was born on Kalf 10,000 years ago, over 10,000 years ago, during the Horus Her Heresy, and Kalf was where the Ward Bearers turned on Ultramarines, wanted to gain their vengeance for what the Ultramarines had done, under the Emperor's orders, for the record. And, well, let's just say they committed genocide. Actually, I think that would be put in it mildly. Like, they completely obliterated the planet or a significant portion of it. And Chiron was there as a child, and he was kept in stasis, became a Primaris uh, space marine, and now he's unleashed in the galaxy over here. So that's one of the reasons. The Ultramarines have a real beef with the ward bearers. I think it would have been more appropriate to have ward bearers in the game for at least this particular section at the very least because yeah and just in general because of the history that the ultramarine zoo have with them but instead we get uh, the thousand sons. But that's only part of the reason. There's also more personal reasons for Chiron that are shown in the game just before this particular uh, section so you do understand exactly why he's really pissed off also it's got to be said that there are sections over here in the game that where Gadriel or Chiron are really really pissed off for one reason or another and the way they take out that anger is to just rush the enemy and kill a tremendous amount of them I guess, uh, really, they're angry marines at heart, not ultramarines, and it's actually Titus who is the voice of reason, so to speak, in the game, trying to keep his uh, brothers focused on the mission at hand. Morales! Is that you? Chiron! Bless the Emperor! It's good to see you. Where's your squad? Gone. Neurothroat tore them to pieces. We need to get across the bridge. Lieutenant, nothing gets across with that beast up there. What are we up against? It has its rear covered and we do not have the manpower to break through. The Cadians are holding the bridge. At great cost. Set up assault positions by the bridge. We'll deal with the Neurothrow. Very well. We will avenge them, brother. Watch yourself. Chiron, how do you know Varelis? We served together in Ninth Company. I owe him my life. How so? We were once defending a stronghold from an orc assault. A war boss overpowered me, had his drill against my head. Varelis appeared, cut the bastard's arm off, and beat him to death with it. Ah. Let us honor him by his incoming. Slain him! Need a ride, brothers. Sergeant, good to see you. The Cadians have the bridge under control. Thought you could use an extra hand. A welcome offer. Climb on. The temple is this way. Lieutenant, the Cadians are requesting support. Go. Thank you, brother. Ultramarines! Have the enemy infiltrated the dome? No, my lord. What about the Temple of Thassian? The dome was evacuated days ago. Rejoin the main force immediately. Our orders are to remain here. On whose authority? Captain Fairburn. We are to hold this position until further notice. The dome is empty. 
Now move on. But, sire... I gave you an order. Forgive me, my lord. Perhaps there was a communication error. The captain insisted. The deserters. No, no, no. We have our orders. Vox, your captain. If you are deserters, I'll execute you myself. Captain Fairburn, come in. Captain Fairburn, come in. Ambush! Cover him! Sergeant, check the perimeter. Yes, brother. Explain yourself. Need I justify my hatred? You need justify your recklessness. The traitors have a debt to me. And you would throw away your life to collect? Death is my duty! Your duty is to the Emperor. You will die when and where he so chooses, not over some personal vendetta. Do you understand? Lieutenant, you should see this. If the chaplain wishes to see you because of my transgressions, I will take full responsibility. I gave no report. I have yet to decide if you require formal penance. Varelis always did put his brothers before himself. He once shielded me from a Tau ambush. Rail rifle nearly took his Over arm here, off along with half my helmet. The one degree of deflection saved my life. We only had to mourn his paldron that day. The Emperor will remember his valor longer after we join him. Forgive me, brother. 